What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Roman, breaking within the last hour in an exclusive. We just learned that Queen Daenerys, none other than Amelia Clark, will be joining the MCU in an upcoming Disney Plus project. We're going to break down where this exclusive is coming from, what they said about the actress, and where we can see her in the MCU coming up on Disney Plus. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we're still giving away a PlayStation 5 at 900,000 subscribers, as well as Disney Plus subscriptions every Friday while the shows are live. If you want to be entered to win, all you have to do, hit that sub button, then leave a comment down below, and if you want, stick around to the end of the video, we'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there. So breaking within the last hour under the exclusive, Amelia Clark joins Marvel's Secret Invasion at Disney+. Plus. They go on to say, Amelia Clark is in the final negotiations to join Marvel Studios' Secret Invasion, the hot original series quickly coming together at Disney+. Plus. The Game of Thrones headliner's role is naturally under wraps and makes her first foray into the Marvel Universe. She joins previously reported cast of Samuel L. Jackson, Ben Mendelsohn, Kingsley ben -Adair, and Olivia Colman. Marvel Studios declined to comment on the matter. Reps for Clark did not immediately comment on the matter either. And then they go on to talk about Secret Evasion being announced this past December and what a huge crossover it's going to be now. With Amelia Clark's inclusion, and you think about the rest of the cast of Game of Thrones, almost every one of those main actors has found their way into a Marvel movie in one way or another. If you include X-Men and New Mutants, it's quite a bit. And my only gripe with any of this is I do not want to see the same actors and actresses that are over in Star Wars crossover into Marvel and vice versa. I never want to see Robert Downey Jr. or Tom Holland as a Jedi, and I really don't want to see Daisy Ridley as Spider-Woman. The thing about Star Wars and Marvel characters, the same goes for DC as well, is that their roles, if they become iconic, they become tied to those roles in a way that when we look at the actor, we only see that person. If you start putting Star Wars actors into Marvel and Marvel actors into Star Wars, the way that they've already sort of proven that they're willing to do if you consider the most recent casting of Moon Knight Oscar Isaac who played Poe Dameron in this most recent trilogy Amelia Clark was in one of the Star Wars films as well she was in the Han Solo film if you start crossing these actors and actresses over like this, then it's just going to start to feel a little bit less than, make it harder to suspend disbelief, especially when and if those characters like Tom Holland's Spider-Man, Robert Downey Jr.'s Tony Stark, or even Chris Evans' Steve Rogers become so iconic that if you put them in the Star Wars universe, you would just see Tony Stark as a Jedi, not Robert Downey Jr. or a brand new character. I know Disney's a parent company and it would make it easier to negotiate contract with these actors that they already have under contract for a different franchise. All that being said, I really, really hope they strive to keep these separate as best they can, especially for the more iconic roles. And we shall see as we go forward into this. But either way, Amelia Clark, Queen Daenerys joining the upcoming Secret Invasion. Guys, let me know all your thoughts down below. What character do you think she's going to be playing? I know there's been some rumors about a scroll queen. It's going to be a big deal. She's not going to play a minor character because that's the kind of actress that she is, especially with the role she's held in her ilk. So I can't wait to see which Marvel character she's playing. But either way, let's get into the giveaway stuff again before I let you go. We're still giving away a PlayStation 5 now at 900,000 subscribers. We just announced the 800k winner a couple of weeks ago. We're also giving away Disney Plus subscriptions every Friday while the shows are live. If you want to be entered to win, all you have to do, hit that sub button, then leave a comment down below. Because it's truly random, the more videos you comment on, the better chance you have of winning. All winners will be selected and announced at the end of videos. The best way to keep up with the content is to hit the notification bell with notifications turned on. And as always, if you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button. My name's Michael Roman. This is Everything Always. You can find me over on Instagram and Twitter at I Am Fires. You can also find me on Spotify, YouTube, and all other music platforms with original music under the name All Fires. Thanks for checking out the channel, guys, and stick around. We'll be posting again real, real soon.